Ma'am, he seems fine. He just seems like a normal 13-year-old kid. He isn't normal. He seems like he... I don't know. He's weird. Um, what is it that he's watching, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> I'm not home long enough to really pay attention. Well, that's the problem. Could you describe some other odd behaviors of his? He's been sent to the principal's office a couple of times, and and there was an incident where he hurt himself. What happened? He came to me saying something about a video, and I ignored it. But then he um, stabbed his finger. This was a few days ago. So you ignored him, and that caused him to hurt himself. Do you see a problem here? I, I guess. Please, please don't say. I believe it is in everyone's best interest if the child is taken back to the foster home here in town, and then we will discuss further about our next steps. I'm sorry. You know I can hear you, right? I can hear you this whole time. And you know what I have to say? I'm not leaving. Because I don't want to leave. I'm happy here in my own picturesque reality. And you can't change anything about that, can you? <laughs> no, you cannot. This is my reality. It makes me... <laughs> It makes, it makes me, it makes me happy. <laughs> I've had the best childhood. It brought me so much joy. <laughs>